Hello learners of all ages, my name is Mr. Montgomery. I teach fourth and fifth grade math, and today we're going to be learning how to add decimals up to the hundreds place. Now again, as I said before in this chapter, the most important lesson when it comes to adding or subtracting decimals is making sure your decimal place is lined up, so decimal point and decimal point, and all your values or your place values are filled in after the decimal place in order to make adding and subtracting much easier. Well, I can add like I normally do, but make sure that I have my decimal place down here in my answer spot. So seven plus six is 13. I'm gonna be carrying my one to the next place value over. One plus two is three and three plus three is six and zero plus one is one. So my answer is one in 63 hundredths. Now, if I'm taking a look at this example, I see that not all the place values are lined up. Now, some students can add these just like they normally are, but I feel like it's best to add and make sure that all the place values are filled in in the tenths place and the hundredths place before I even start. That way it mitigates any sort of chance of mistakes. So seven plus zero is seven. Nine plus three is 12, carry the one. And one plus one is two. Actually, I could do the one and the four is five. Five and five is 10 plus one is 11 and make sure that my decimal places are all in line. So 11 and 27 hundredths is my answer. Now on your homework, they're gonna ask you to align and then add. Well, my trick for that is to make sure that I have my decimal places first. And I'm gonna be going number by number. So in this number, I have 10 and two tenths. 10 is on one side of the decimal place and two tenths is on the other. 15 and 79 hundredths. 15 is on one side of the decimal place and 79 is on the other side of the decimal place. And I see that I have one place value that is not filled in. I could fill it in with a zero and I could add these together to get my answer. Zero plus nine is nine. Seven plus two is nine. Zero plus five is five. One plus one is two. And make sure that my decimal place makes its way down. 25 and 99 hundredths. All right, my fifth grade friends, we're gonna be on page 175 of your workbook. We're gonna be doing practice problems number three and 11. The directions say use the place value algorithm to add. That's just a fancy way of saying, make sure that your decimal places are lined up. Make sure that you're starting from the far right hand side and adding like you normally would. If you have any questions on how to add decimals up to the hundredth place, please let me know when you come to class tomorrow.